hi this is vasant kumar varma yeah just now we are going to start our uh, drupal configuration just go to the mm, go to drupal dot org then there you can find an uh, drupal uh, latest version at present we are downloading the drupal 6.0 and drupal is an open source yeah and we have just started our download process Just extract the mm, extract the Drupal six onto the desktop. Then you can find a folder like uh, unzipped file of uh, Drupal six point zero. Uh, mm. Yeah, just go. Uh, just check that uh, an uh, XAMPP was installed on your system or not. Just uh, rename it as uh, Drupal. Mm. Drupal and uh, copy this uh, to my computer's C drive where your uh, XAMPP has been installed. Uh, according, yeah, in my system it was installed in uh, program files and uh, XAMPP, and you can see the HD docs file like, and you copy this Drupal, mm, you copy and paste the Drupal here, and the file will be copied. Yeah, just yeah. You just run your local host, like HTTP local host slash HTTP local HTTP local HTTP local host slash Drupal. Then you can see this. Uh, choose the language. You know which are the languages. You can install generally by default. We are going to install. We are going to install this Drupal uh, in English, and generally it will be asking us the, to give the database name and the database username and like and database password. Generally we are not. Uh, mm, uh, we have uh, we have not yet created the database name. So just now we are going to create this database name like. Uh, we can have. We are just. We are going to use this uh, localhost slash php my admin. That is our MySQL database localhost. And now we are going to create the database of uh, db underscore uh, Drupal. And just you click the create. Mm, the you can see this database has been created in the top like a database uh, db underscore Drupal. And you just give the name of the uh, database db underscore uh, uh, drupal mm, drupal and the user database username is root and there is no password till we have not yet kept any password and see the initialize uh, initializing the drupal is is almost completed and it is going to ask us uh, the site ad site email address like uh, just we are going to give my mail id and and the administrator username is admin and for that you are going to give the password of 4emc912 and just enter the password repeatedly and it just shows the password strength as a medium because we are uh, using like uh, characters and uh, mm, characters and and the numeric letters uh, yeah okay Jen you can click the save and continue 
here because we have not able uh, because uh, the SMTP port has not been enabled uh, so it is showing the email uh, error if this could has been rectified then you can find uh, you can find the email has been sent to your uh, uh, to your me email id and uh, please review the message above before continuing on this your site generally now you can see the local host of the drupal on your system on your local mission then you can see like my account create content administrator and log out 